Morning everybody. Today we're on Tattoo Trail 161. And uh, we um, are gonna hike to a couple of uh, peaks, potentially. And the, uh, it's been a wildflower report of uh, avalanche lilies. So it should be, uh, it should be good. Wow, that's a nice looking flower there. See the red stripe on the bottom? <laughs> Looks like a candy cane. Yeah, I'd always say it was a pen stem, but I don't think so. I'm sitting here at the base of this rock cliff, covered in ferns and moss. Okay, you can take a look at these steps right here. These are about almost knee high. Something 13. It's probably as long as it took him to climb up here. And I. Uh, Injured my foot back in November, several months ago. It was a long time before I could do any exercise on it. Only recently have I started running. So, in a pretty sad shape. And then uh, below those, we have this pen stem right here. It's kind of blue with purple throats, very tiny. Too close, might be too close. Different kind of paintbrush.
Can we take a guess on this? I am going to say it's Sitka valerian. Look at the leaves there. Things look like candy. Look at that, that's a, I'm trying to think of what kind of candies I remember. I remind me of, I think it was something really old. It's meadow, it's full of flowers. Wow. Okay, so as you guys can tell, we, uh, we've kept going. I am just exhausted. It's hard to put one foot in front of the other. <laughs> it's just like, I'm so out of shape. Um, anyway, so we're still here, still hiking. And uh, I've tried to show you the, the flowers we've seen on this, this trail. Just phenomenal, amazing. Last time I saw it, I was uh, was in Sammamish, Washington, in a neighborhood of all places. And yet here it is, right now. I tried to get my shadow on it.
Okay, I got some avalanche lilies. Yeah, a couple, a couple hundred feet elevation and all the flowers are gone. Wow, well, it's not as, uh, it's not as lush as it was. Wow, looks like snow. That's amazing. Man, they're beautiful up close and they're beautiful at a distance. Yeah, I can't say for certain, but I think that paintbrush right there is endemic to Rainier National Park. It's got some name like Crimson Paintbrush or Magenta Paintbrush or something like that. There's more of it up there. Don't really want to walk on the plants so. though. Jeez, more of it up there. See, saw these in Rainier National Park years ago. We went through a patch there where there's the flowers were like looked like they just barely started to come out of the ground. The, you know the plants barely started to grow. Uh, no flowers, hardly any flowers, and now we're. That bear grass up there, and now we're kind of back to uh, these wildflower type meadows again. Yeah, this view and these flowers are just amazing. And yeah, so anyway, um, I, don't, I don't know what to say. <laughs> For once, I'm without words. Um, these flowers have just been amazing. It was uh, the whole thing was worth these wildflowers that we saw? If you like this video, give it a like, um, share and subscribe. 
Um, I appreciate all my subscribers. A great deal. And I will see you next time.